Hey, what's going on guys? DJ Baseball here. Back at it again with another video. Uh, I just want to start off saying um, I'm sorry I didn't do a box opening on this. I've been very cramped, obviously, because it's baseball season now. Um, I've had three games so far. I've only played in two. I had a uh, quad injury, so I missed uh, the middle game after getting injured in my first game. But I was able to play yesterday, which is great. Um, I'm, uh, batting 333 right now, and, uh, well, I'm only one for three, because I, I have, like, four walks, which is crazy. I always get walked, it's kind of annoying. Um, and my team is, uh, one and two, and, um, this next couple stretches, uh, a couple weeks will be, uh, definitely over 500. Because our first two uh, games are out of our conference. They're in uh, the schools we play. Like, our schools go, like, 1A, 2A, 3A, 4A. We were playing 4A. My school's 3A. So we were playing up. And those teams were pretty good. Um, we stuck with them. But uh, now we'll um, pretty much take over for the rest of the year until we play some of our tougher 3A opponents. So, yeah. So... Um, sorry I didn't do a box opening on my new glove, so I'm just going to do a first impressions and a review so far on this, and an update, basically. And I'll be doing a lot of updates on this as I go through. So let's go ahead and hop into it. Um, this is my new, uh, Wilson A2K 1786 Pro Stock Slick Leather 11 and a half. Alright, um... I got this in on Wednesday, and I obviously didn't play in my game on Thursday, so I didn't use it. Um, I used it on Friday, and I used it yesterday in warm-ups. I still wasn't, uh, my coach didn't want me to play in the field just yet, so I was, I, I basically just DH'd yesterday, so that's fine. Um, I probably would be playing in the field on... Let's see, I'll probably be playing in the field on Tuesday, hopefully. So, yeah. So, um, this is how much use gotten it. It's got dirty. Got a finger stain already. That's just from sweat. Um, no oil on this glove yet. And then, here's the break-in so far. Pretty good already. Um, so, my first impressions on this glove is... It's outstanding. Um, I now have both of the basically the top uh, top um, uh, the highest quality for both Rawlings and Wilson. I have a Pro Preferred and now I have an A2K. So definitely look for a um, comparison video between the two um, for sure. So, yeah, my first impressions is this glove is absolutely outstanding. Uh, I noticed that um, the double palm construction is really helpful for me because I have beefy hands. I know I do. So I, when I squeeze, I kind of push through the palm of, like, a normal glove, and it's, like, they're a, little, they're a lot thinner than this. And this is, this palm construction helps. This almost feels normal to me. Like, I still push through it a little bit. But this is much better than, like, a Heart of the Hide or an H2000. Speaking of an H2000, I actually had to sell my H2000 back to my friend. Um, I, uh, well, he needed the glove back because his, uh, his other glove... Um, the laces are, like, snapping, so I just basically, just, uh, he just basically gave my money back, and I could just give him the glove, so that's why I bought this, and yeah, so let's go ahead and hop into the overview of the glove, so, uh, we'll start on the back of the glove, so the back leather right here is black, your Wilson Power Strip is I believe this is walnut. Um, correct me if I'm wrong. I believe that's walnut. This looks like walnut to me. And then the wrist to the thumb. The thumb is walnut as well. This part right here is black. The web is walnut. 
and the palm is black, all black. And the lacing, the lacing on the website said it was blonde. That is not blonde. It's more so tan than blonde for sure. Vintage tan maybe. I don't know exactly. Um, but I like the look of it. It looks really sick. It gives the glove a lot of pop. Um, here's the stamping. So A2K right there. Wilson right there. Um, Pro Stock Leather, Select, Pro Stock Select, that's the highest end, uh, Wilson Leather. Uh, 1786, 11 and a half. And then the date code over here is AHR. And then the, um, MLB logo is black, silver, and maroon, which is pretty nice. All right, um, let's keep going here. Uh, let's hop into the review section. Um, leather quality, absolutely amazing. I'm just going to give it 10 out of 10. It's it's an A2K. What do you expect? Oh, I forgot to do the... So it's black back with white. Mm, that's more silver. Silver logo. So, white back with a silver, white back with a silver, or I said white black, but it's black. With This is either silver or white, it's kind of hard to tell. I'd say it's white, but in the in the light it's silver because it makes it shiny. Alright, back into the, um, the review. The Wilson leather, this A2K leather is outstanding. I uh, definitely will give it a 10 out of 10. The comfortability... Oh, it's so comfortable in the the finger stalls. I don't know what it is. This glove is very very comfortable. Definitely another ten out of ten. The liner is amazing. I I love the A2K liner now. Um, lace quality is terrible. It's absolutely terrible. It's so thin, so so stiff. As you can see, it's like they're already curling up and they don't want to flatten back out. They're, they're just terrible. Um, that's okay. Um, I really don't mind. Once it pops, I'll relace it, whatever. Um, not that big of a deal right now. And the overall quality of this glove is outstanding. There's no stitch out of place. Um, definitely recommend this glove or any A2K at that fact. And here's the ball in the pocket, guys. That's where I got it. I've gotten it so far. Right there. So guys, I know this was all over the place. I'm pretty tired um, from my game yesterday. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. More to come. Definitely expect the comparison between that and that. Um, for sure. Uh, and I hope you guys enjoy this video. Like, comment, and subscribe. This is DJ Baseball, and I'm out.